friends, thanks for joining me today. We're gonna to go ahead and heat treat this little hatchet I made in some oil. Okay, so we have a welding magnet here. The steel is just regular mild steel and the magnet sticks just fine. If I put it to this edge where it's been heated, it doesn't stick. So that's where we want to heat it up at. Now you can see it's cooling off now. I'm gonna go ahead and stick it back in, get a little bit hotter. What we don't want to do is overheat it. If we overheat it to where it's kind of sparking by itself, we've overheated it and we've ruined the steel and we can't make that nice hardness again. So what we'll do, we'll heat up just a little bit longer then I'm gonna dip it in this oil and move it around a little bit. It's gonna have some flame on it and I'm gonna keep moving it around until it cools off enough. That's going to harden that edge and make it more resilient when we're doing some cutting. Then I'm gonna temper it a little bit I'm gonna wait for it to cool down, and then I'm gonna stick it back in the forge, heat it up till it's almost like a hay color, like a darkish hay, or not hay, more like straw, a straw color, and then I'm gonna let it just cool, and that's going to temper it, bring the harness down just a little bit, so it's still hard, but not brittle. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, here we go. Hold your breath. It's best to do this in a well-ventilated area. This doesn't produce as much smoke as I've had happen in other times. We just hardened the edge of that blade. We didn't harden or we didn't um, heat up that whole thing so we don't have as much smoke. So I like to move it in a figure eight pattern so it's moving that oil around the whole thing. And then I'll bring it out here and then I'll let it sit and I'll let it cool. And that is the hardening process. So like I said, I'm gonna let this cool way down. Then I'll stick it back in the furnace probably tomorrow or something get it up to it's almost a uh, straw color, and then it'll be ready to use. So that's it, folks. That's, that's what I do for hardening. I've had really good luck with this method, and uh, things have stayed sharp. So make sure to work hard, folks. Hard work is its own reward. And thanks for watching.